things in our lives we've done the shit yeah things in our lives that we just pretend they're not there cause the one we're still done regardless of the problems and I won't stop the search looking for some help Where are you going? Since when did you start asking me where I'm going? I'm just concerned, that's all. Well, you don't need to be concerned. <clears throat> but you're the one who told me you're going out. You should be glad I'm telling you I'm going out. Don't wait up. in our lives we the not sure there are things in our lives that we just pretend they're not there cause the one we're still done regardless of the problems and I won't stop the search looking for some help Two services on Sunday. The first is at 10 a.m. and the second service starts at 3 p.m. Very well, sir. We look forward to seeing you. God bless. Bye. Rachel. Don't you have any eyes? Ma? Why were you still seated when the others were standing? Ma? Ma? Don't you have any respect? Oh. I should have stood up like the others. Praise God. She finally gets it. I'm sorry, Mommy. I didn't see you. I was on the phone. And so were the others who stood up. Or are they stupid? I'm sorry, Mommy. Today is my first day here. Besides, I didn't know I have to stand when you walk in. Now that I know, it won't happen again. Of course it won't happen again. Because you no longer walk here. So I want you to pack your bags. Off you go. Ma? You heard me. You're sucking me? What have I done wrong? Are you really saying I should leave because I didn't stand up for you when I was clearly on the phone trying to get someone to come to church? Don't let me repeat myself. Now, what's your name again? Rachel, mommy. 
good. Rachel, or whatever you call yourself, I am not in the habit of repeating myself. So I am going to say this again for the benefit of your stupidity. Now I want you to pack your bags and get out of this office. kindness upon our lives. Um, so I want you all to stand up on your feet today and help me welcome our pastor, Pastor Gary. I do not know if you are here today, mm? but God told me that there's somebody here. He has reserved something special. Amen. Amen. I don't know if you are here, but if you are here, I want to hear a resounding amen. amen. Uh, let's be seated for now. The Lord spoke to me today. And he has a special message for somebody who is special. What did I say? Somebody who is special. And um, turn your Bibles to the book of Matthew. I've been praying for a minute, getting closer to God. Lord, forgive me for my sins. I don't know who to trust. Little sis getting older, I know she need me around. I got the world on my shoulder, I just spin it around. But I woke up this morning, thank God I'm blessed. So I wrote a sick verse just to nod my head. I got a hair to my left and a Bible and a dash. There you are, Pastor Ote. Do you have a minute? I'm eating. Okay, I'll catch up with you later. All right, I do have a minute. I'll plan it for you. Thank you. I want to talk to you about something. What about? By the way, there's some salad over there. You can help yourself to some of it. My bad. It's sorry. You don't need things like this, do you? Thank you. I heard and saw what happened this morning. Pastor Rota, many things transpired this morning. What I'm trying to say is that I deal with specifics. So what exactly did you see and hear this morning? Pastor Uche, the way you spoke to Sister Rachel this morning wasn't nice. It was highly ungodly. And who are you to tell me what's not nice and ungodly? She says she's not coming back to church. Good. Another ship lost. And another ship will be replaced. Look, is this what you came here for? Because your woman was up a long time ago. Oh, oh. honey, there you are. 
Pastor Gary, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, Pastor Rhoda. How are you? Very well, sir. The sermon this morning, it was wonderful. I was richly blessed. All thanks and glory to God Almighty. Hmm? Honey, okay, salad. Uh, is there some more? Because I am hungry. Sure, you can help yourself with some over there. I will help you with that, sir. Thank you. I will take my leave now. I have some people waiting at the church auditorium. Good day, Pastor Uche. Good day, Pastor Gary. Is anything the matter? What do you mean? The way you looked at Pastor Rhoda, you did not even acknowledge her greetings. You know what? I'm going to be very tired. You need to go home and get some rest. I'm going to get my hair and nails done. Sister Miriam, how, how are you? Oh no, what, what happened? Oh no, 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 no. i tell you what, um, send me the address of the place. Yes, yes, uh, no, no, don't worry, it will be well. Uh, send me the address, the postcode and all, uh, I'll see you shortly. Where are you going? To the police station. Sister Miriam's brother was arrested. <laughs> you see? You see the kind of people you have in your church. And yet, you say I shouldn't send them away. Judge not. So you will not be judged. The Lord Jesus Christ said, He that is without sin should be the Lord Jesus Christ came to this earth for the sinners, not the saved or the righteous. And he has ordained me to bring hope to the hopeless. Hmm? I've been praying for a minute, getting closer to God. Lord, forgive me for my sins. I don't know who to trust. Little sis getting older, I know she need me around. I got the world on my shoulder, I just spin it around. But I woke up this morning, thank God that I'm blessed. So I wrote a sick verse just to nod my head. I got a hit it to my left and a Bible and a dash. I'm talking much bigger plans, but you wouldn't understand. God is great, so evil I can't really comprehend. They say they ride for you. But never pedal to the end, I've lost love for the ends I need to formulate a plan We were rock bottom, they had us buried in the sand Sometimes I find that I start talking to myself We ain't never had a choice, they ain't never give us help Mama tried her best but couldn't do it all herself Made my own mistakes, then they threw me in the cell There are things in our lives we better not share Things in our lives that we just pretend they're not there. Cause the world will still turn, regardless of our problems. And our stuff the search, looking for some help. Hello, darling. Home alone. has gone running again. Apparently, Sister Miriam's brother has been arrested. Yeah. 
He seems to have time for everybody else except me. Okay, okay. Later then. I was watching that. So you're standing here and you're asking me what's wrong with this food? Does it have too much pepper? Too much salt? Is it not cooked well? The food is fine. Then what is wrong with the food, ma? Oh, so you don't know? Well, Daddy just said the food is okay. Daddy did not employ you. I did. And so you answered to me. And so you think the food is okay? Go to your room, pack your things, and get out of my house. You're sat. Thank you very much, ma, for giving me the honor to serve you and your family. God bless you. Get out! What has come over you? Hmm? you? You have changed. No, you have changed. Ever since you became the overseer of this church, you have turned into a scared chicken. Nobody does wrong in your eyes anymore. So I have to step in and put you in check. After all, isn't that what a good wife is supposed to do? Be your helpmeet? Getting closer to God, Lord forgive me for my sins, I don't know who to trust. Little sis getting older, I know she need me around. I got the world on my shoulder, I just spin it around. But I woke up this morning, thank God that I'm blessed. So I'll go to sick first, just to know my head. Uh, Florence. Here to my left, and the Bible and the dash, I'm talking much bigger plans. Please, but could you tell uh, uh, the rule that I will see so her outside of the garden? They say they ride for you. But never pedal to the end of lost love for the ends. I need to formulate a plan. I'm fine, Mark. Thank you. 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 Just pretend they're not there Cause 
No, please sit down, sit down, sit down. Uh, uh. Anyway, ah, uh, how are you? I am fine, Pastor. Mm. The Lord has been very merciful. Yes, yes, he always is. It is well. Thank God. So, um, can I offer you anything? Uh, coffee, tea? Oh no, Pastor, I'm fine. Thank you. Well, I'm happy that you're fine. Because if you wanted anything, I wouldn't be able to offer you anything. I do not have a cook anymore. Oh, well, I just saw Florence now. What happened? Madam, Madam Sata. I am so sorry. No? It's not your fault. What, what really happened? It was. Well, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> So, what did you want to see me for? Hmm. I have actually come to speak to you about Pastor Uche. What about her? Pastor, I do not want it to seem like I'm reporting her to you. But a lot of the members lately have been leaving the church because of her. Why? They are not happy with her attitude towards them. Hmm. Pastor Rhoda. So now that you've finished telling the pastor what you came here for, you may now leave. 